Day 1, Genesis 1 1 5. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. The earth was formless and empty, with darkness covering the deep waters. God said, Let there be light, and there was light. He saw that it was good, separating light from darkness, naming the light day and the darkness night. Day 2, Genesis 1 6-8 God said, Let there be a space between the waters, separating them. He created the sky, dividing the waters above from the waters below, forming a canopy around the earth. God called this space heaven and completed the work of the second day. Day 3, Genesis 1 9-13 God said, Let the waters beneath the sky flow together, and let dry ground appear. The waters formed seas, and dry land emerged. God called the dry ground earth. He then said, Let the earth sprout vegetation. So, plants, trees, and vegetation of every kind, each bearing its own seeds, came forth. Day 4, Genesis 1 14-19 God said, Let lights appear in the sky to separate the day from the night. He created the sun to govern the day and the moon to govern the night, forming stars to light the darkness. These heavenly lights marked seasons, days, and years, shedding light upon the earth. Day 5, Genesis 1 20-23 God said, Let the waters swarm with fish and other life, and let the skies be filled with birds. He created great sea creatures, every type of fish, and every kind of bird, blessing them to multiply and fill the oceans and skies. Thus, the fifth day came to an end. Day 6, Genesis 1 24-31 God said, Let the earth produce every sort of animal. He created livestock, small animals, and wild animals, each according to its kind. God then said, Let us make human beings in our image. So, he created humans, both male and female, to rule over all living beings. He provided plants and fruits as food for all creatures, and saw that everything was very good. Thanks for joining us. Consider supporting the channel by subscribing and liking. Enjoy! And if you liked any story from Bible, and want to see it here, leave it in the comments along with your opinion and feelings about this passage.